So many choices, what do I try first? Hey Best Pally, I'm Allie, and for a long time now, I've been cleansing my buttocks in a very inferior fashion. I used to use toilet paper, what am I? Oliver Twist? I don't know, I'm just trying to think of a poor character. But then, I upgraded to a bidet, and you may have seen the video I made about it. And one specific person did see that video, the owner of Dignity Solutions, a bidet company, and he emailed me and was like, do you want a way better bidet? And I was like, ah, psh, no, what am I, the Pope? I don't need heated tush water, just kidding. I was like, yes, I need that immediately. Now need is a strong word here because this company actually makes bidets to get into the hands of people that truly need it. I've been chatting with one of the founders. Hi, Sam here with Dignity Solutions. Sam is awesome and so is their company mission. He wants to help people that would otherwise need help in the bathroom. He's made me realize what a loss of dignity it is to have to get someone to help you and he wants to get rid of that discomfort and help people that either have a disability, maybe they're aging, there's a remote control in this and of course that sounds dope but it's specifically because it can be pushed with an elbow, you can put it on the floor if you don't have arms. So Dignity Solutions truly cares which baffles me that they sent me one because the first thing I'm gonna say is my old one was called an Aster and this one's called... <laughs> I'm sorry, okay, and this one's called a Cascade. Ugh, okay, I'm done. I'm not done. This is... Let's get serious here because honestly I do believe in this company. And I do want to mention some benefits of a bidet beyond just helping people with mobility issues. You will use less toilet paper, which this one also dries you, so you need zero toilet paper, where the one that I tried before uh, you still needed to kind of pat yourself off. Less toilet paper means you save money. Less toilet paper also means it's better for the environment and better for your toilet because you're not clogging it up with business. It can also be easier for people with hemorrhoids, which I've heard you can get from lifting it. It's more sanitary. I don't have to put my hand anywhere near my posterior and the not scraping down there is better for your skin. Now that I convinced you that you need a bidet, Let's convince myself that I need the Cascade 3000. I've installed one before, so obviously it's gonna be super easy and I'm not gonna flood my bathroom. You can heat the seat? Shut up. It's not just warm water. Oh, that's great. And the lights up at night. Oh. Which I imagine is also for helping people with vision issues. Thank you, Sam. Speaking of vision issues, I feel like this seems more complicated than the last time, only because I wore glasses in the last video. Here we go, about to saddle up on the cascade. Wait, that's not right. Maybe I'll just make it appear on my toilet. Oh, there we go. All right, yes, I got this now. Here's the remote. I can't wait to surprise my friends from the kitchen when they come use my toilet. Just kidding, this is not a prank video, but maybe in another video. Wow, look at this beauty. Come on out. Honestly, I mean, you're looking at my crap cow. This is now the nicest seat in my apartment. It really does seem like the Pope probably has one of these. I'm reading over the other features now. There is a rear and a front wash. Oh, that's awesome. Also rear head. <laughs> but like, only having a back wash. My other bidet is sexist. Dry button, which I mentioned. There's an auto so that you don't have to push rear and then dry. It just does it itself. Also, now my toilet is smarter than me. Smarter than me because I just unscrewed what is not the battery cover. Wow! Great job, Specs. Anyway, moving on. Heat the water, you can heat the seat. Oh, you can heat the drying air temperature. Deodorize mode? No. Deodorize mode is active and runs automatically as long as the seat's occupied. There's a small fan that pulls the smelly air out. Through an active carbon filter. Good lord. You can change the water pressure, the nozzle position, and it has a self-cleaning nozzle. And it's coated with a silver nano compound that keeps the wash water sterile. Oh my goodness, I've been washing with dirty water. And my toilet has something to say. Our mission is to support the independence and dignity of all people. We are dedicated to providing bathroom solutions specially designed to meet the needs of the elderly, individuals with disabilities, and caretakers. Wow. Thank you for helping us make this mission a reality. <laughs> You are welcome, toilet. Actually, I mean Sam. Sam is awesome. He sent me a personalized video just to say thanks and help me figure out what size I should get. Like, he pulled out a selfie cam for me. What a cool dude. All right, on to the loo. First step is to get rid of this one. Oh, <laughs> my toilet has gained some eyes since the last video. I'm very excited for my upgrade. I'm also getting rid of my toilet seat because I'm replacing it with that. Although, definitely look for this as a prop in upcoming TikToks. Almost forgot to turn the water off. I think I'm supposed to do that. It's weird flushing the toilet in this space, not hungover. Just kidding, I don't get hungover. Except for all the videos I did trying to cure hangovers. Okay, get rid of you two. And while I'm at it, might as well get rid of this. I'll mail that to Oliver Twist. Now this T-valve needs to get replaced with that one. Well, this is the scary part 
this maybe waterfall. And I'm extra nervous because my glasses failed me on trying to figure out the batteries on the remote. Being a little drippy. Uh -huh, success. And I uh, Harry Potter the other guy on there. Well, this plate goes on the top and that big thing just slides into it. If I did this right. I'm staring my toilet in the face as I do this. Now this thing goes right here to get the water into the bidet. And now I should be able to just slide it in there. Whoa. That was, that was way too easy. Did I really do that right? Holy crap. Ha! Pun. Yep. It is in there and on there. Huh. Nice. And it says tighten it just a little more once it's slid in. Now here's why we need the T. That goes on there. And now water on and hope. Eep. And leaks. Nope. Good job, toilet. Let me in already. And here I go, mixing electricity and water. We have sound. We have a light. There was a beep! That was a beep! Obviously a success beep. I'll give you a close-up look at this butte. Now there are instructions to test out if it's working, and it knows when you're sitting on it. You can't remote control it without a person because it's that smart. So you have to fake like you're a person here, and then cover the nozzle because this is going to hit me in the glasses otherwise. Wait. Oh, I think that's the disinfectant. It just... It knows I'm here. Now I'm going to hit rear wash. And nozzle comes out. What the, oh my goodness. Okay, yep, that's, it sprayed. Nozzle retracts. That's cool. It's cleaning, wow. I am thoroughly impressed by a Heine wash. I haven't even got to the remote yet. Ooh, okay, we got water temperature. Let's just crank that up, shall we? Sea temperature. Hi, that's right. I'm gonna cook an egg on this. Okay, yeah, I know. It, I'm here. <laughs> Where am I gonna get this to the face? What does the odor button do? I feel like it's deodorizing and I don't even know it. Oh, there we go. That's the sound of less bad smell. Oh, and I should also mention that most bidet seats are made not to be sat on, but this one can hold up to 300 pounds and it shuts delicately. There we are. Now let's really take this bad boy for a test drive. Having a first sit. Oh my god. It's so warm, I forgot that I heated it up! It knows I'm here. Oh, this is awesome. I can't believe I've been sitting on cold toilet seats my whole life. This is living. Where's my laptop? I'm just gonna get some work done here. Let's get her going. Water temperature's already heated. <sighs> so many choices. What do I try first? Rear! It's preparing to clean me. Oh my gosh. <gasps> okay. <gasps> wow. Oh my goodness, it's so warm. Oh, it's lovely. This is great. It's like a hug. It's a butt hug. It's like if you could sit on a fountain. You know how the mall fountain makes you feel just looking at it? Imagine if you could sit on it. Oh, it's like a hot toddy, but on your bar stool. This is great. I'm gonna adjust up. Ooh, it moved forward. Forward. Oh, wow. My butthole could be anywhere. Back, back, back. This is awesome. Okay, hold on. Stop. He's cleaning himself. There's more. Men, you can skip ahead. Let's try front. Again, toilet is preparing itself. Oh, wow, okay. Hey, I am never wiping again. This is fantastic. What does this plus do? Oh, stronger. That's if there's a whole lot of debris. Wow. Less, less, let's be gentle. In case you have a delicate little lady. And stop. Ah. It listens so well. Thank you, toilet. I'm like grateful for it. What I'm extra excited about. Dry. <gasps> Stop. What? It's like 15 angels breathing on me. <laughs> no way. Oh, wow. It's like you're upside down in one of those hair things at the salon. It's like if a gentle breeze and your underwear had a baby, it would be this feeling. Wow, wow, wow. Ah, uh, moving up. Adding more air. Oh no, that's adding heat to the air. Ooh, toasty. This is nutso. Man, I can just sit here and warm up on a cold day not even related to using the toilet. Okay, stop. One more thing because pushing all these buttons is just too much effort. Boom. Auto. It's going. One button, that's all you need, which I imagine is very important if pushing buttons is hard for you. Again, Dignity Solutions is adding a lot of dignity to the world as I speak on camera while getting my butt sprayed. Oh, it's oscillating. Oh my goodness. Wow, do I like auto. It's uh, it's having a time down there. Huh, I also like that it makes the self-doubt of did I go long enough disappear because it does 
a set amount of time and now it's dry. Now let's just get rid of a little odor. I will repants myself and another big thing in this video. If you're one of my pallies that needs assistance in the bathroom or you know somebody that does, please let me know and nominate a person in the comments that would benefit from this so they don't have to have someone else help them. Because Sam and Your Dignity Solutions is giving away one of these bidets to somebody who needs it. So again, if you know somebody that really does need this and would get their dignity back because they have a Castor 3000, let me know in the comments and we're gonna randomly pick a winner. And in terms of my review, well, toilet paper is the bottom level of clean you can get. My other bidet turned out to be a bummer. And as for the Castor 3000, well, you saw all the features and all of my reactions, so I'm pretty sure you know my opinion. This bidet makes me feel gluteus maximus. I'll put a link to the Castor 3000 in the description, and if you want more fitness outrageous help, that's down there. <laughs>